Good morning, this is Dennis Smith and it's Wednesday and we're going to talk about uh, the cattle market today and this is a two minute drill only. Give me two minutes, it won't last any longer than that. Cattle markets just had a substantial break in prices, we're like $7 off the recent highs. Cattle on feed report viewed or the perception was that it was quite negative. I don't really think it was. And the marketings is what I'm focused on and cattle marketings are becoming aggressive and this is real good news for the cattle market. Marketings were higher in April and marketings were higher in May. Correction, marketings higher in March and higher in April. We are seeing good marketings in May as well. Packers are becoming much more aggressive and the result of this is a sharp decline in cattle weights. Cattle weights are down 42 pounds from the first of the year. So these are all real positive things. The industry or the trade was surprised by the 107% marketing pace during April or, or the placement rate during April, but it was a very small placement rate of a year ago. So when you're talking about percentages, it can be a little bit confusing. Wholesale beef is sharply discounted. It's down 15%. At times it's been 20% lower than a year ago. The market's at a sharp discount to cash. Packer margins are very positive and we've seen a big decline in retail beef prices and this is a real strong seasonal demand time of year. So the bottom line is we are not bearish toward cattle futures expecting a nice upside recovery. This has been the two minute drill. Next week we'll be looking to talk about the soybean market. These thoughts are my thoughts and not those of ADM or of ADM Investor Services. Thank you.